Oh, he is a fine deer. I'd say it's about 20 inches inside. Might be a little bit young, though. But if he knew I had just scope right on his head, he wouldn't be sleeping. shot him. <laughs> I was leaning when I shot him. And I look at that other deer that just come back out. See him standing down there? <laughs> what just happened just now? Oh, dude, I, I think we took a really nice one. He, uh, he come in and was standing with several other ones. And I was, uh, we couldn't get together to see which one to shoot exactly so we could get him on film. And he finally kind of was moving. He stepped out between some trees and I took a shot. I was leaning to my left. But I think I hit him pretty good. He, he's out there. But man, that's... Good job, man. Whew. There's a, that's that one that was laying on the ground looking at us. Yes. All right. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Big heavy eight point. Big ninth gear. Big tick. God, yeah. Oh, that's great, man. That is great. Good big symmetrical buck. I'm proud of this deer for sure. All right. Good job. Cool. It's about 2.15, Saturday, uh, December the 3rd. It's a really nasty front coming through. The wind's just really, really tough. Uh, I saw this buck earlier, and he was with some smaller ones, and I, I passed on him, hoping that, you know, he might come back. I didn't have a good shot opportunity. And uh, we sat and was patient for a while, and he showed back up. Uh, I, I was very fortunate enough to get him. And especially get him on film is a really good deal. I, I really want to give props to Jayhog for making this possible, and uh, it's a really good deal. Uh, thanks for a hunt of a lifetime. Thanks.